Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Gungnir! Last time, we defeated the last of the bandits, finally! We don't have to deal with them anymore, and we're going to just be kicking ass and take names the rest of the way. So, yeah, that is the thing about the mid-game, it, it is a bit of filler there, but, oh well. The end is really good in my opinion, so. Oh, well, someone should have. Oh, is that the guy from before? Oh, well, nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm sorry I, I didn't bother to walk out and save your lives here, but, uh, yeah, I, did, I didn't want to risk my life. Oh, okay. What do you mean by that? Why are you worried? Oh, well, okay. Well, Julio is the one in charge here. So, what's going on? Oh, I thought you were just like one of the rulers. Why would these guys want to help us, so? Well, what's going on? Oh, you mean deported? Oh. Oh, well, thanks, I guess. What's the problem? Uh, well, you, so you don't have, or wait, why do you need to clean up our mess? What do they want? What's going on? Oh, well, I guess, sure, why not? Really, huh? That's weird. Man, Alyssa really is getting a bargain on uh, ascending the throne. It's like, yeah, can we have citizenship? Yeah, that's fine. And uh, can we, you know, send some Jehovah's Witnesses around? Uh, okay, sure, I'll give you that in exchange for being uh, put in charge. That's not how you spell judgment. Well, at least not in my book. My book, I don't put an E in the middle of it like that. Ah. Nuts. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Please buy things illegally, but uh, don't sell any humans. You can't do that. But, uh, yeah, buying uh, drugs and illegal weapons? Yeah, that's fine. I wouldn't worry about that. Oh. Well, thanks. Oh. Well, sure, why not? Uh, yeah, that's the general idea. What do you mean by that? I don't want to know. Don't answer that, viewers. Well, we've been doing pretty good so far. Well, what are we supposed to do then? How many troops are we going to get out of this deal anyway? Well, they'll get the job done. What do you mean? Ah. Okay, I guess. Oh, well, no, of course not. Now you're just talking crazy there, Paulo. So what else do we got going on? What do you mean? 
it doesn't seem like it. Well, yeah, that's usually how wars go. Of course it's violent! It's a war! What did you expect? Well, yeah, that's usually what happens in war. Maybe you should have worked out a deal or something, or negotiate. Oh, nuts. What do you mean? Well, everyone's got an agenda, apparently. Well, yeah, that's true. Kind of need some help. Worry about the details later. That too. Oh, well, yeah, we've been kind of running for our lives for a while now. Uh, no. Oh, yeah, we got a whole bunch of people, huh? Well, yeah, that's the idea. Oh, yeah. What do you mean? We can do it. Oops, sorry, I skipped that too quickly. Oh, well. Well, yeah. Could be worse, Julio. You could have the Bailey curse. Never goes away. Oh, well. Yeah, all of them, huh? Well, I got the spear. That seemed to do a pretty good job. Well, yeah, that would be that's part of the deal. Well, now we got the troops, so are we gonna get back on the road? Alright. Okay, so first thing first, backup save, just in case. And we've got a lot of new stuff to buy now that we're in uh, Millennia here. So let's see what we got. Let's see, where is it? Maybe I passed it up. Hmm. Ah, there it is. The Lava Rod. Basically, uh, the same thing as the Icicle Rod, except it's... Uh, has a lot better offensive abilities. Not so much on the uh, crowd control, but that's okay. Yeah, it's really, really good for him. Although I do still want to hold on to the Icicle Rod anyway. Then I want to get the Book of Kiri for Paulo too. Uh, that, that is the only grimoire in the game, I think, that has all four specialty abilities on it. I think there might be one more, but it's impractical to get. So, yeah, definitely want to get the Book of Kiri. You could go with the... Uh, what's the book we have right now? I forget the name of it. Let me see. Where is it? Book of Eleanor. You could use that for the rest of the game if you really wanted to. But I think the Book of Kiri is a little better there. Okay, so let's see. Don't need any shields. Body armor. Dragonia armor. Empire Dragonia? No. That's another game. But I do want to get that because it absorbs pyro or fire elemental damage. That's really good for Julio or Joseph there. Okay. Oh, you could also get a what is it? The Sylphie Garb to absorb air or prevent negate air, air elemental damage, but I don't really worry about that. This one absorbs it, but I don't have anyone who can use it. Okay, so next I want to get the Brigandine. It's a pretty light piece of armor. Gives you 30% defense reduction. It's really nice. I think it's like the best armor in the game for defense, physical defense with, that doesn't reduce your movement or jump stats. So, yeah, definitely want to get one of those. Uh, let's see. Where's the other one? Um, I forget. I thought I got a Lorica earlier. 
Well, you know what? I'm gonna buy another one anyway, just to stay on the safe side. That'll work. Okay, let's see. I want to get a Queer Ass, the only body armor in the game, I think, that can boost your hit stat. So that's really good for him. And let's see. A bit Benny Shigure, or however you pronounce that. Really good piece of armor for Alyssa there. Also has some uh, status resistance on it, oddly enough. And it's pretty light. So let's go with that. Okay, headgear. We want to get the pumpkin hat because it can prevent curse. And it's the only thing like that that can. that Paulo can equip this. Definitely want to have that for the future. Let's see, Angel Halo. I want to get that for Alyssa because, well, as you can see, it prevents the undead and curse status. And yeah, we want to watch out for both of those. Okay, hand armor. Let's see. Ah, uh, there it is. The serpent. Uh, nice thing about this one, uh, it does have a casting stat, which is interesting, but I don't really use it for that. I mostly use it for the boost to boot to in or increase my ailment infliction rate. So I want to buy that for now, even though I don't have someone who can equip it. We will later on. Okay, and here we can get the mighty Apollon shoes. Has a decent counter number in the lower left there. Boosts your movement by one. And it's pretty light there. So I really like that one. And let's see, one more thing. I want to get the talisman uh, for more curse protection there. Anything else here? Oh, if you're short on uh, gems, you could buy all these roses here and refine them, but I'm not. Black Fan is kind of interesting. It has a boost that can, uh, yeah, reduce enemy tactics points by three. But I never use it, so I wouldn't worry about it. It is kind of interesting, though. Okay, I think that's everything there. By the way, I do want to upgrade both the Lava Rod and the Book of Kiri to level 9, but I will do that off-screen. So, let's see. What do we got here? Julio! Uh, where are you? Okay, so let's put on the Dragonia armor, because some enemies coming up are going to have fire elemental attacks, and so that'll make him immune to that. Let's see, I want to go for the stone head for some good physical defense. We want as much of that as I can get. Okay, let's see. Then I want a savage hunter for you. And let's see. Uh, fire boots as well to protect against the burn stats. So, yeah, that'll work really well for us. How are we doing on capacity? Yeah, we're doing good. We can even go a little over 80% now because we're going to have six party members for the next battle. Six potential party members. Okay, so, uh, Paulo. Let's see, you got new weapons. So let's get the Lava Rod and the Book of Kiri going. It's going to take a little while to do all that. Okay, where are you? Okay, let's see. I want to put the Aqua Robe on, which protects against burn and fire elemental damage all in one. Really good piece of armor for you. And, let's see, get rid of that to clear a little cap space. That ought to be pretty good. That's all you really need. Let's see, Joseph, we still got the sunrise. Um, yeah, I want that, because I'm going to be breaking some shields coming up. Okay, let's put you on the brigandine, then. We'll be able to buy more brigandines and dragonia armor later. Okay, let's see, let's move these down. Not that it matters, but... It helps my OCD. Okay, yeah, so we got that. Headgear. Beast Bone. How's your defense? 70%. Nice. How's yours, uh, Julio? 65%. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, Martin. Let's see. Pretty straightforward here. Don't need that anymore. Let's see. Let's go with the Queer S that I just bought. Uh, let's see. Yeah, move that down a little and get some headgear going. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, not great, but oh well. What can we do? Okay. Alyssa, how are you doing? Let's see, we can keep working on the arrow heart there. Let's see, okay. We want the new uh, Benishigure for you. 
And let's see, let's get you... Yeah, we don't need the leg warmer anymore. I don't think any enemies remaining in the game can inflict freeze. But anyway, yeah, water veil, overdrive. Uh, yeah, I think that should be good. What about the other weapon? The uh, Lily Bell one. Whoa, that puts you right up to the max. Like, dead on. 130 over 130. I wouldn't want that, though. Uh, let's see. What if I did that? Hmm. You know what? Let's do that. I'll make an impromptu change. But I do want the Arrow Heart to be my active weapon, because it has a guard rate of 15 compared to the Lily Bell one, which is less. Okay, and yeah, that ought to be good. Okay, well, that's everything there. Anything I should sell? So you want to hold on to the battle axe? We can break some armor coming up. Icicle rod is still useful for inflicting silent. So you want to hold on to that. Book of Eleanor, I don't need it anymore. We can get rid of you. Okay, shields, nothing. I suppose I don't really need to refine leftover armor. I could just sell it. But I'm in the habit of refining anything that's not a weapon or shield. So I'll just go with that. But yeah, let's see. We want the Sun Cloak, Mermaid Pareo, Lorica. See, we don't need that anymore. Let's see, we still want the Valiant Robe, too. And we can get rid of the Joker there. All right. Let's see, for headgear, we want the Pointy Hat for silent protection. Uh, let's see. Okay, the Holy Brim for later. See, I'll hold on to the Water Veil for now. Pumpkin Hat and Angel Halo we want for curse protection. Let's see, hand armor. Don't need the arm guard anymore. Let's see, serpent is good. Aggressor I don't care about. Still want to hold on to the two wrecker gloves coming up. And let's see, we don't need the leg warmer anymore. So let's refine that. Fire boots is good. Don't need uh, Shurikagakes anymore. Let's see, I only need one pair of wheel boots now. Apollo shoes I want, but not right now. Uh, insect shoes hold on to. Heavy greaves. Yeah, let's uh, get rid of those. And, okay, I think we're good. Uh, what was it? Oh, there's one other thing I wanted to mention. Uh, we got the Defender Gloves, which are pretty good because they give you 15 defense and they're a little lighter than the Arm Guard. So if you wanted to go for that, you could. I'm not going to. But, I mean, it is a thought. I just like the Savage Hunters better now because we're going to run into a lot of enemies that have shields for the remainder of the game there. Okay, well, let's uh, move along then. Plan our next move. Well, she's got to hang out somewhere. Well, yeah, dying. What do you mean? Well, what would the other decision be? Just run and hide for the rest of our life? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, we're all using each other, aren't we? Well, yeah, we are. What do you mean? We're still allies. We're fighting by each other's side. Oh. oh, okay. Well, hopefully it'll all work out. Why only her? Well, I guess she's the only one there. Yeah, we're helping each other. Uh, why? You're not going to tell us, are you? I mean, I could understand, like, making hard choices or tough love or whatever, but, I mean, cruelty? I don't see why that would ever be necessary. What do you mean? Oh, well, that's rather uh, prejudiced of you. But, well, I suppose you can't expect 
attitudes like that to go away overnight. Oh well. All right. Now can we get back to kicking ass and taking names? Yeah, we're not even going to bother drawing a line to get there. Uh, just assume we get there in one chat. Ha ha. Well, how long has it been? I mean, it's practically been a year since then, hasn't it? Something like that. I mean, we've been walking around for quite a while. Couldn't we, like, get a wagon or something? Or a horse? Or a chocobo? Or something or other? Ah, Nelson, at last. Revenge will be mine! What do you mean? Well, you did earlier. Didn't seem to have a problem with it. Yeah, that's true. What do you mean? How do you know about all that? What do you mean? Ha ha. Not again. Well, this one's going to be quite a bit harder than the last time. Oh, yeah, I suppose someone has to. Well, goodbye! I'm sure everything will work out so much better for you than it did for Pierre. Ha uh ha. -huh. Well, at least Nelson seems to be remotely honorable. What do you mean? Uh, we still gotta go through, uh, the Shield of Gargania. Or Fort, uh, whatever that place is called. <laughs> well, we got a whole army this time around. Well, that's okay. I've already gotten all of your, uh, weapon mastery that I care about anyway, Alyssa. You'll be fine. Thank you. Even though I haven't been working on your weapon abilities, that's okay. But Nelson doesn't have any uh, witty retorts or anything. Not like uh, Pierre, apparently. But all right. So uh, one thing I do want to do in this battle, let's just put Julia there. Okay. Yeah, this is the chest that I wanted to spawn. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to reload my save file when I record the battle, but oh well. But yeah, I, th I thought it was over here, maybe. Hmm. Well, anyway, yeah, there's a chest around this area that has a piece of armor that I really want to get in that battle. So when I actually go off to record it, I'll have to make sure that that one's there. But can we defeat Nelson and retake Victrion? Find out next time on Let's Play Gungnir. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.